Hello everyone, welcome back to the Coding Ninjas YouTube channel. So in this video, we will see how we can build a logic for the coding problem. So first of all, you have to read the problem very carefully. See, what you can do, you can write the points given in the problem on a notebook. Actually, the thing is, whatever is given in the problem, we have to use that thing while solving the problem. Sometimes it happens like something is given in the problem, like all the numbers are non-negative, right? So this can be a very good hint to get some logic in your mind, right? So you have to basically use everything, whatever is given in the question. So you should write all the points in the notebook and then try to think of the logic. While thinking the logic, first you try to match the problem with the previous problem that you have solved. If this is a new problem, then what you need to do, you need to think what are the operations that you need to do. So if there is any insert operation, any delete operation, now think what are the operations you need to do. So when you are done with the operations, then you think of the data structure, which data structure will help you doing this operation in the minimum time, right? So what you have to do first, understand the problem very carefully, then try to build the logic, try to match it with some previous problem, which you might have solved. And if you have not solved, this is a new problem, then try to think what are the operations you need to do here. And then think of the data structure that will be helpful in this case, right? So in this way, the logic building can happen, right? And guys, don't write code if you don't know the logic. Don't directly begin writing code while thinking the logic. When the logic is clear, when the solution is clear, then only write the code. So these things will help you in building the logic for the coding problem. Follow this. Thank you, guys. Hi there. We hope you liked our video and found it useful. We would also like to inform you that Coding Ninjas has come up with a scholarship test called CNSAT. If you participate in the test, you can avail up to 100% scholarship on any course in Coding Ninjas, may it be TSA, web development, product companies, interview preparation, data science, or any other course. So click in the link in the description below or the pinned comment and participate in the test. Happy learning, guys. Thank you so much.